Now to the growing problem of reckless driving on empty city streets in the midst of a stay at home order. News 4's Alexis Zotos is live downtown with details. Corey, unfortunately, we're still seeing a lot of that reckless driving happening tonight here on 4th Street behind us. It's clear now, but we've seen people going at least double the speed limit and take a look here in the parking lot. You can see the evidence of where people were doing burnouts and donuts here in downtown. Police say there were over 200 people here this afternoon. <laughs> Video captured and sent to News 4 shows drivers doing burnouts in the parking lot near Bush Stadium Sunday afternoon. But the real danger is the drivers speeding on the city streets and bikers popping wheelies. Traffic is light because of the stay at home orders, but police tell us there were roughly 200 people in downtown, some in their cars, others standing and watching. There were several calls to 911 and more than a dozen St. Louis City police officers responded to the scene. In addition to the reckless driving, the large groups were a direct violation of the social distancing and stay at home orders banning gatherings of more than 10 people. Now, St. Louis City Police Department told us earlier this week that it was not their responsibility to police the large gathering aspect of those social distancing and stay at home guidelines. They said that was up to the health department. However, it is their responsibility to prevent reckless driving happening on our streets. We're told one person was arrested. We're working to get more details on the charges. Reporting live, Alexis Soros, News 4.